I meant to enter this um, in previous years, but I didn't really think I stood much of a chance. <laughs> um, but I wanted to go for it this year. I went for it quite close to the deadline. Um, I just picked um, a song I performed very recently. Um, it's Miracle from December by EXO. I performed it in July. Um, a bit out of season. Still out of season now, but <laughs> there we go. Um, so yeah, I did that and um, uploaded it. Um, sent the email off. I was just like, right, now we just wait. And um, obviously there were a bunch of people posted um, that they'd had notification emails saying they got through. And um, I felt quite disappointed. I was like, well, obviously if everyone's been notified, that means I haven't made them. It was kind of out of my head, really. Like I just kind of let it drop and forgot about it. And then um, I checked my emails when I got home from work today. And there's just this email sitting there, sort of results from, you know, the K-pop World Festival. And I was like, well, I'm pretty sure I'm not through. So like, I wonder what this is. Maybe they've just sent a blanket email to everyone else. Like, thank you for entering. Like, sorry, I didn't make it this time. And I was just like, oh, happy to announce. And I was like, hang on, <laughs> hang on, I'm, I'm doing this. I'm actually, I'm, I'm through. I'm, a, I'm a finalist, and um, I'm performing this Saturday in a really amazing club, and I am not prepared. <laughs> oh my god, I just, I screamed. Like I never scream at anything, but I was just so excited. I was just like, <laughs> um, I think my brother was having a nap at the time, so I'm pretty sure I woke him up. So, um, sorry. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I say it's Miracles in December by EXO. So really pretty valid. Um, an unusual choice maybe, because it's obviously by a boy band. Um, and the verses are very, very low. It's um, quite challenging for my lower range. And um, for a guy it'd be easy. <laughs> um, but yeah, so it's quite low, very low, soft in the verses and then kind of gets stronger and a little bit higher in the choruses. Um, but it'll be, I think my main challenge will be conveying the intensity of it, given the range. Um, but I really hope I can do well and that I pronounce the lyrics well <laughs> and um, I just want to go and have fun and prove to myself that I can do this and um, even if I don't get through like I don't perform very much anymore I'm quite shy and you know have a bit of an anxiety disorder and um, I just feel like it's a good chance to prove to myself that um, I have what it takes <laughs> so and I'm quite insecure. I've never considered myself to be like an amazing singer or anything. I've, I've ne I was never naturally gifted and I've tried really hard. I've had to work so hard just to get to the standard I'm at now and I'm still not completely satisfied with it but um, all I can do is my best <laughs> and um, hopefully hopefully they'll be impressed with that. Um, so yeah. <laughs> um, I entered the Career Tourism Organization's singing competition in 2012 and won and got a free trip to Seoul off the back of that. Um, and I entered K-pop star um, that year as well because it came to the UK for the first time. And um, I was a European finalist. I was one of 12 called back from the hundreds who attended, but um, didn't get to go to Korea at that time. So this is kind of my third attempt. <laughs> um, it's been 10 years, 10 years that I've been into K-pop and sort of Korean culture and at the start I never could have imagined A, Korean artists coming to the UK to perform and um, B, that I would end up performing Korean music myself, <laughs> like it seems kind of crazy but it's been a really long, really interesting road and if this was finally it, if I finally got to go to Korea and perform that would be <laughs> all my dreams come true right there. That would just be amazing. Uh, um, I legitimately don't know how I would cope. I would, I would cry, cry so much. My heart would burst and just, it would be an absolute mess. I just <laughs> um, but yeah, so fingers crossed, wish me luck. And um, if it goes well, then I suppose you'll see another update soon. <laughs> oh my God, I can't believe it's on Saturday. The Korean Cultural Centre in the UK are obviously behind the event and um, they're coming to my house tomorrow <laughs> um, to interview me. I'm a bit nervous, I've kind of had a tidy up of my room. <laughs> um, I can imagine they'll come up here and they'll like sort of hang on a tree, have a look around it. So the posters, uh, my little K Dot collection. I said little, it's quite big. There's a lot more than that as well. <laughs> 10 years worth of stuff guys, <laughs> but yeah, so 